That's beautiful. <laughs> yeah, even, the, uh, <laughs> even, the, uh, even the bear. Even a bear like the disagrees. Bear, yeah, the bear disagrees actually. <laughs> What's up, guys? Welcome to Geek Brew, home of the Geek Brew. It's your boys, Just Grave. Herbal tea in the back. Uh, guys, guys, guys. First story of today for the Geek Brew news. Brew news. Sony. And I know you guys probably heard like all everything. He's slipping. They're Sony slipping. slipping. I don't understand. Like, even the most simpleton, the mo- the stupid simplest minds in the world, even if you like have this much knowledge of like computers or computer science, why would you put? P- why would you put all, like all your all your known secrets, in plain text? Yeah. Right. Like so, pretty much anyone that once they get into that ser- get into your server. They got it. They just have to download. They don't have to encrypt. They don't have to de-encrypt it. You just download all of Sony. With a, it was a hundred. Download your RAM. And was it was a hundred terabytes worth of stuff. I'm pretty sure. Hundred terabytes. Like yeah, I think they probably seen it. Here. It's over here somewhere. But a a, a load a, a shit ton, a <laughs> shit ton, a shit ton, a shit ton of terabytes. A shit ton of terabytes was stolen from. Uh, yeah, so that's next unit of some oh, Sony from the GOP, right. not the Republicans, the Guardians of Peace. That's what they call themselves. Well, but, uh, kind of the same uh, model that the, the Republicans <sighs> want to use. Even yeah. they, end up, they actually do end up the same way as these GOP as well. So, yeah. so I mean, they think they're the good guys, but they actually are the bad guys. Yeah. So it's like, uh, ah, man. so yeah. Yeah. there, there's been some good things that came from the leak. We actually, you f- actually get some. Uh, I guess the innards of Sony, if and you get to see, they have some emails between um, Sony and Marvel actually. One detailing a Spider-Man um, animated movie, and another one de- detailing a uh, was it a um, three movie deal. So a three movie deal. But Sony would still hold the rights, but Mo- Marvel would well, film they'll everything. Yeah, they'll they'll probably br- they'll, they were supposed to bring it into the Avengers. Yeah, so they could do that and bring it because they wanted them to. But they also had an email with them trying to get Spider-Man into the new uh, Captain America movie. Um, oh, that's what it was. Yeah, that's, that's what. I'm sorry, but but it wasn't Avengers. Pretty much, no one would budge, and yeah, that's one of the good things. You could see the inner. It's like, okay, you always wanted to think like, how could how do these these businesses work? And you see how, and you can see the innards of them, how they work. Um, also, this is, I guess this is a post, also a couple of funny um, tidbits of some emails, how some uh, employees are like, like, have email wars back and forth between, between no, each other. So it's, it's a couple of arguments in the workplace, but that, that's normal. But it's so funny that you can like, oh yeah. I'm just gonna let me just download the file and see how they argue. You can <laughs> know what Jim and uh, accountant thinks of Bob down in yeah, down in um yeah. I mean up in um um cu- cu- uh, custom relations <laughs> when they exactly. think about each other. They hate each other. They fucking hate each only other. Only office politics. <laughs> office politics. <laughs> Actually, you can see they can steal all these arguments and make a, make their own show. Make their own soap opera. They can make their, make their own, own office. Ma- make their own, exactly. Make another office. Make another like a little mockumentary uh, comedy show, and make mil- make millions. I mean, that, all you got to do is that. All you got to do is make millions. Yeah. You know. So it, like so. So who knows? Also, who knows so they pretty much they also amazing. the GOP, um, threatened sent threatened emails to all the the um the employees and CEO because they have the emails now, mm-hmm. and. To threaten them if they, even though it sounds it sounds like they ran their uh, the threat between like using Google like um, translator, so it makes it seem really weird and like it makes it seem that it could have been the North Koreans, mm-hmm. but there were also emails de- van- demanding money. So that if you were all, if you were if it was North Korea, it, no matter how bad they the like how terrible the North Korea is, they're not looking for money. They're usually they're looking for their own agenda. They're all about propaganda. So 
they they did say, oh, they get rid of the. They always need money, but they're not gonna take it. Yeah, they they, they say, oh, get get rid of this terrorist. Um, the terrorist mo- pretty much the interview, but the get the movie the interview. But it seems like it might be a little bit more. And the FBI pretty much already ruled out um North Korea, so yeah. And it's so how much like oh, so many movies that were leaked. It's a good read if you wanted to see how how not to run a, a business. How not to have one hacks happen, and especially to the same company. Yeah, Sony already Sony. been hacked before. You've been hacked. It wasn't. It wasn't the, twice a year. It wasn't Sony Pictures. It was Sony. It was. It was um, Sony um, Computer Entertainment. Yeah, but Computer but Entertainment. But you've been hacked already. So, I mean, hire there, people. There's an next door. Yeah. <laughs> Sony <laughs> Pictures is like yeah. the next door to, to Computer Entertainment. Yeah. So hire some people. Hire some tech. Uh, some um security. Analysts, the security. I'm, I'm sorry, c- c- security like analysts, like um, professionals, and get your systems up there because you anyone can get hacked. I know that, that's true, but if you had a comp- like security computer science analyst there, a consultant, he would have make sure that oh, let me see your service. Wait, all your information is n- is plain text. Exactly. There's no co- encryption. No, no. no, that's the first thing to go. That would have ha- that would have been the first thing to go. And it all has to be connected to a server too. You know, you don't have it like taken off to other yeah. like, uh, and, like just uh, externals uh, on the side. You, mm-hmm. t- you want to put this in? You want to bring this up? Put it in? Yeah. You know. So like, yeah, that's yeah. You know, a whole lot of things that so you know, that, that could have been done. There's a whole bunch of stuff more leak movies. You you want to you want to read it? It's a couple articles. This is one of the articles we got from him. Um, in gadget, so yeah. All right, next the go- uh, back with um, some good Sony news. Uh, if you guys have not seen it yet, this is uh, pretty much an unboxing of all the new uh, Sony, the new Sony um tw- um twenty an- um, twentieth anniversary on um, PS4. Releases. So they use the color scheme of the. The, the PS, the PlayStation One, PlayStation all games. gray with the the, the classic um, the, the classic um, graphic design. Yeah, it's awesome. Even though it, actually it's not that much of a um bad of a price, it's about f- well it's already sold out, but it's it's mm-hmm. about like uh, was it five hundred dollars I believe? No, it can't be that bad if it's already sold out. It's it's yeah it's, it's not that bad. They grabbed it, but. It's a uh, it's about five hundred dollars give or take, and you get a controller, the PlayStation um I or whatever they call it, the camera the eye toy yeah the eye toy whatever they call it, so it's not bad of a, a deal because I think the eye toy toy by itself is about sixty bucks, and P- PS4 by itself if you didn't kn- well without the Black Friday deals and all that, the PS4 is like about five like four hundred dollars. Plus tax, so it's about the same price. It's about the same price if you just bought the I with it. It'll be like four something plus tax will make it five hundred dollars. Exactly. <coughs> so yeah, that's pretty sweet. It's already sold out, but the only thing like I w- I would do the same thing for my P- my PS4, but I feel like I can just go to a, one of those the colorware websites and stuff, get like like send it in, get it colored, and just make find like one. of I could definitely probably or print find out. A, find a, yeah, find a way to get a skin. Yeah, for it. and print and print out or get a skin uh, and print out that little logo and pretty much have the same thing and yeah. probably have like some um get some spray it, paint. have some uh what's it called the carbon wraps yeah. the little wraps or they could wrap around and make it all gray. I think they already have a gray one get like spray that. paint or something. Yeah. A gray one like that. Yeah, we could spray I mean, paint. It's all if the, you're an artist, then like shit like this doesn't really. Affect you. It just that uh, it, they all, the only thing is that that's awesome is like they're all numbered. So I think they have this little badge here and they're all numbered or something like that. So it's pretty yeah. dope. That's the only thing that you really can't get. It's like oh this is this is about twelve thousand three hundred of them and you get this is the eight thousand two hundred sixty six sixty second version right there, yeah. which is dope. Which speaking of it, a uh, store in um. A st- a, the, one of the one of the PlayStation stores mm-hmm. in um in London, I believe. Yeah, yeah, in London. 
actually sold the console for 20 bucks, so 20 well, pounds. 1994. 1994. Well, it's a gimmick for, you know, the first the first year, it, the year it was released, yeah. you know. If, if, if they, uh, I know they probably didn't let you buy more than one, but. Oh, no, no, definitely not. No, nah, but, like, if I could buy, like, I would just buy that, sell my PS4, like, or even just buy that and sell that, because speaking of, like, reselling, I mean, soon, yeah, soon you're going to see that in a, um, in a game store. Yeah. Nearby. It was, like, for like encased in glass. For, like, a whole bunch of money. Like, how they had, like, gold, uh, a gold PS3. Yeah. Oh, no, a developer's PS3. For, like, I don't know, like, about a thousand or something. Yeah. You know, it made sense, because, you know, yeah. the debug things, but, yeah. but to the, be honest. For the resale, like, there's already been one sold for about 1500 1500 no, fifteen hundred thousand. Sorry, because the, because the bot. Wait, wait, fifteen thousand then. Fifteen thousand. Yeah, because the buyer didn't like go on the internet at all. I guess. No, he probably did, but on well, eBay, he probably wouldn't intend to buy it. To buy it. Go on the internet he didn't get. He didn't, it. No, he probably he tried to get. Probably probably tried to get it, and then never. And then pretty much got sold out. So the only way is through eBay. Yeah. And uh, but the thing is that he probably could still got cheaper on e like cheaper than that on eBay. So one guy sold it for fifteen. Another guy sold it for a dollar. But it, yeah. it most likely seen that he pretty much made his mistake of the um, on the pricing. They started like the starting bids, and for some reason, like usually the e for eBay, most people would put that one dollar bid starting bid. But he probably didn't put enough time on it. He probably didn't put like a couple of days on it, and they, that's what he usually do. He probably put it like for like an hour. Instead of like and a week, saw it, yeah. and then so and then someone just one person saw it real quick, bid on it, and made it a dollar. They usually they put it for a week, and then that one dollar, it goes usually to like eight hundred dollars because least, yeah. every single person saw it and they're like, oh shit, I need to bid on this, and become the bidding war. So yeah, and the Can lowest and the lowest the yeah. console the lowest has really been sold is for five hundred dollars, which is the same price. So I don't know why someone sold that, but actually no no hold on. oh that's just a picture. That's a, well. I don't know if someone bought that. That's if someone bought a picture, like a picture of the console for five hundred dollars. They're retarded. <laughs> wait, but dude, that was just for a picture of. I don't know if anyone home. bought it. They said just. They said uh, wait, the second, wait. the second lowest price I found for the console was five hundred dollars, but it was for the console, the picture of the console. I don't know. Yeah, if chances are someone bought a picture of the fucking console. I don't know. Then it could be just like the guy for Xbox for the Xbox One who bought the picture for the Xbox One. It may be him. It could have been. It may be him. <laughs> no, yeah. but he may he may be in, in that he may become notorious. Because like e of eBay pictures of eBay he may have a picture of a PC in his house too. Yeah, eBay the things about eBay they, they make sure like 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 say some people, there's some scammers, what they do is they make sure the wording is correct. They make it bland. They make they make not bland, they make it like fucking in your face. Oh, this is just a picture. This is just a picture. Just a picture. Just a picture. But people are so like some people are so like quick to try to get a deal instead of reading that's why the subscription is there they just like oh click oh i'm gonna click i'm gonna buy it oh i'm gonna get it for mad cheap and then everyone else that didn't buy it's like, oh i wonder why no one else bid and they look and everyone else that didn't bid they look like wait frame it says a frame of the picture like oh no because you got, the reading is fundamental don't just start buying things this is ebay just because there's a picture of it doesn't mean anything. stay in school kids stay in school all right all right. Speaking of uh, games, more games and stuff. Um, the Game Awards uh, was uh, this week. Um, pretty much. Oh damn! I just had. Uh, yeah, Jeff Keighley. Jeff Keighley of uh, the VGAs from Spike TV decided to make his own uh, video game awards. Yes. And he wanted to make it more respectable. Make him like VGA had uh, the VGA had a lot of. Uh, performances a lot of like little like so he tried to make pretty much make it all about the games and make it like similar to how the Grammys were all about like mm -hmm. like pretty much how like make it on that level so Probably they had a, had a few different um trailers new trailers had uh was it No Man's Sky had uh mm -hmm. they showed um Metal Gear Solid um online the new Metal Gear Solid online for um the Phantom Pain when it comes yeah. out uh they showed a whole bunch of stuff um, 
they even uh, announced without uh, yeah they announced all this stuff. It was, it was pretty good. It was it was all about the games. They had like one perf- like a couple of performers like two, Imagine Dragons. Yeah. They even had one of the guys from Imagine Dragons come up, and the way he like he talked about games and stuff like that, you can see that he was a gamer. He was like really like even though he's a magician, he sounded like really awkward. <laughs> he was talking about games. He was stuttering. Like he, he just he was talking about his old old games about like I don't know if it was uh, Earthbound or something else, but he was talking about yeah. some old all these other games and it was it was pretty like heartfelt. I was like okay, this guy's a real gamer, and they really got like an artist that also was pretty famous, like pretty like they had their careers pretty up there, but also loved games and it was pretty dope. And they also did like in renditions of uh. On their set, they were uh, doing some renditions of like Mario Kart, oh. Zelda, all these old old games. Like just doing like a little riffs of the old games. It was pretty dope. And and, I, and since they streamed it on YouTube, you can just watch it here. You can watch the whole. Even though it's kind of long, it's like three hours, but you well, can skip through things that you don't want to watch it's since it's on it's YouTube. Like for the it's not the average award show. Yeah, it's all average. Yeah, I remember. Uh, yeah, I remember the VGS was about three hours. Just nine. Yeah. Always. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, it's average. So yeah, if you like to watch that, you want to see that, pretty dope. Uh, check it out. And speaking of that, the next day there was the um where the PS4 uh, unlimited edition um PlayStation um four uh PlayStation one college game console was announced. They also announced Final Fantasy VII for PS4. But the port. Wrong. They weren't wrong. The yeah. port. Not a remastered yeah, edition, but the port that everyone has. It's already on a PC. So when did it come out? Like 97? It's, yeah, it's already on a PC. It's a, they already, they, they, like, like people already modded other games. People already yeah. m- made Final Fantasy. But the thing is that when Final Fantasy came out on a PC, on like, video. was it, um, let's see. The original one came out on a PC a long time ago. Yeah. And then they re- did a re release. With a, be- a little bit better graphics, or like bumped up the graphics, so it made it, the controllers a little bit better to handle now. Yeah. That was like in that was like not that long ago, and now that version they p- put in ported it over to PS4, which is retarded because no one wants to buy that game. We have bought that game multiple multiple times. I don't know why they're not. Some people have probably even played it on every all right, console. All right. Yeah, Square Enix. All right. So this is how you make money. Redo the game from top to bottom. It's not that it wow. can't be that hard. You guys are making this huge, huge game for uh, was it uh, was it fifteen Final Fantasy fifteen, and it looks amazing. Mm-hmm. So just redo that. You guys are redoing um the Kingdom Hearts series. Yeah, you guys remade like like two point. F- doing like HD two point five. And you gonna make a whole bunch of money off of that too? How long ago? Yeah. S- follow what Nintendo's doing. They're getting their g- old games, especially th- th- for Zelda. I guess like that's one example. And they're remaking it and, and making Star Fox. And Star Fox. Fucking finally Star Fox, man. Yeah. I'm on the start on Star Fox, man. I'm yeah. waiting. Like oh, that was actually announced at the game awards. Yeah, no, I saw yeah. it. Yeah. 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 I'm, I'm, I'm so. So, so that just do that because you I could swear I could swear to swear to God this comes out this is going to sell horribly and you're going to say pretty much you're going to say oh no one wants this game see we made it like no it's not like you, they didn't want the game we want you to remake the game you showed us a demo it's your you guys shot your own self in the foot yeah he's you five you nine showed us a ago. fucking amazing demo Amazing nine, nine demo. Years ago, nine years ago. Nine years ago. How long did it take so for you guys to make it? Yeah. You know, so if you, if you if you had you had to build you had to have it running in the engine, like you had to make the models and stuff like that. This use the same like not use the same thing, but use the blueprint you were using for that and do that. No, the, why make a demo when you can make a game that can make money? That demo didn't make you any money. That demo was just oh, let me show that you had to pay people to do that. No, yeah. like dude, you you're scared at square. You're in financial trouble oh, yeah, yeah. you're losing money every year people are not buying Final Fantasy 12 like, X 2 3 4 like Kingdom Hearts is becoming your Final Fantasy yeah Kingdom Hearts ah. is, is, what, is pretty much what people like, Kingdom Hearts you're going to make a lot of money your new Kingdom Hearts game 15 you're going to make a lot of money especially when you guys said especially when you guys said you're considering everything under Disney's umbrella so the Star Wars and Marvel 
everything that, that Disney owns. Yeah. You guys are considering that. You actually probably got a, a higher percentage of of followers and fans because of that. So, I mean, don't have them wait like another year or so. I mean, yeah. no listen, one listen to this and make sure Justin doesn't catch a heart attack. Right? Yeah, exactly. No one, one wants this fucking... G- <sighs> Alright, let me go there. No one wants that game. You're gonna melt the hoodie off this dude. <laughs> it's gonna go away. It's gonna... It's exactly. gonna burst into the flames. Alright. Uh, uh, also, uh, at the same conference, at the same Sony um, Experience conference, uh, they showed 16 minutes of... I'll have to find that, but they showed 16 minutes of Uncharted 4 gameplay. Yes. And it looks amazing. The It's so fluent. It, it fluid. And it's like... It is flows. It, it felt... I don't know if that was in-game. It felt like... Yeah. It looked like it was just all scripted. A move, yeah, it like it was... It a is no way... Like, everything looks so scripted. If that's how you can play the game... That's going to be amazing. Also, uh... The two rivals, of course, are back at it. Uh, Troy Baker and Nona North are both... Uh, Nona North is going to be, of course, um, Nathan Drake. He's always been Nathan Drake. But Troy Baker is now is going to be his brother. Wow. They haven't named him yet. But, yeah. It's looking up to be pretty good. So, yeah. That's going to that's gonna be dope. That's pretty dope. Also, oh, oh yeah, I forgot. Uh, they also announced um, Yakuza 5. Mm-hmm. And uh, well, because Yakuza Five and Persona Five is already coming out, but they didn't announce it on the PS4. They're coming out for the PS4 in North America, so uh, yeah, of five, nec- yeah. uh, I think next year. No, no, Yakuza Five. I remember hearing that coming out for the PS3. PS3? No, no, no. It's coming for PS3, but now it's coming out for PS4. They announced it on the PS4, I believe. It should be. I yeah. Mean, so. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So um. And I think it's supposed to be it's come overseas. either this. Actually. I think it might be this year or next year. Four. No, I think Persona Four is two thousand. I mean, P- Persona Five is two thousand sixteen. Oh, it's, it's a four or five. No, I think it's five. Five. Yeah, yeah. it's coming yeah, out yeah, 2000, yeah, 2016, 2016 or two thousand fifteen. I'm not really sure. I know I looked at it, but I can't remember right now. But uh, yeah, yeah. So that's gonna be good. And also, they are, oh, five, there's so many fives. Street Fighter Five is coming out. Yeah, right. A little mini rant. Now it's only on the PS, like PS4 yeah. and the PC. I have a PC, so it was fine for me. Yeah, but I PS4. know for a fact, uh, well, our friend has, he didn't get, he got, he had a PS4, but gave, gave it away because there wasn't, there's not a lot of games for it. It's a good friend. And pretty much, I know he's going to want this game, and now he's going to have to buy a PS4 for it, which is, eh. That makes yeah. sense. It makes it's a next gen, but people that have Xbox Ones that had P- that had super, super all the Street Fighters, the Super, the Alpha, Al- Alpha, the Ultra, Mega, Ultra Megas, Extreme. Yeah. Now they can't play the game because exactly. it's, not, it's exclusive. It's, it's not a time game. exclusive. Yeah, it's a full exclusive. Yeah, the, uh, yeah, the, uh, and and pretty much the only the only like smidget that they they have the only string they're hanging on is that okay, yeah, the PS4 sales were pretty uh, were, pretty good. Were, yeah, so pretty that good. so they, just that. You know, but Xbox now, One's like, like one catching up now. Now they're getting more games, but I don't know. I think I think they're just riding on a whole jump for the PS4. Yeah, that's the, th- the thing is that that's I don't, uh, I don't think they should should do that. Pretty much, the what the main factor is pretty much Sony is paying them. Even though they said Sony Sony said it's saying oh Sony paid them to help them to make the game, but they made a collective with all the Super Street Fighter Alphas, blah blah, all those games. They made about a collective. They they sold about a collective eight million units. So, if they sold about eight million units. They have money. They're not bankrupt. So they can make a Street Fighter Five. Street Fighter Five was coming out. If Sony didn't come to them, Street Fighter Five would came out for all the systems. They and all the systems and PC. It would have came out for all of them. Yeah, they won't. Yeah, the only besides besides we, but yeah, like, that, it would have come out. The only um the only issue was again that um Ono. Kind yeah, he kind of did announce that. They didn't have the the, uh, the right resources for a next time game. Well, not yet. Which is but the thing is that they would price. they would have pretty much had to, had to when they had it. when they had the budget, they they weren't gonna, they didn't want to make a game at that time because they were still were milking Super the Street Fighter yeah, Four. Yeah, they want to have um um super, uh, have um Ultra coming out. Yeah, that, that, before, when they before, said that before, when before, before Ultra came out actually. Yeah. They said they didn't have them um, the the right resources. Yeah. So, but the thing is that that was last year, 
And that, that was also when they said that they weren't going to bring um, Street Fighter to Street Fighter Four to the for four to the PS4. And it, and they did. They brought they brought them um, Street Fighter Four. I forgot, I forgot what was the last one, but they they brought that to the Xbox One and the PS4. And that was the same. That was the same article that said that. If I'm correct, I don't don't quote me, but I think that was the same article that said, "Oh, they, we weren't going to bring it to them, and they did bring it to it." So, and that was like that was a well, while yeah, ago. Yeah. So. Well, then I don't, I don't have the, those nice consoles, but yeah. I, 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 I'm guessing because I know yeah. um, Ultra came off a of PC, but that, that was as far as I'm calling. Yeah. You know? So. I mean, yeah. they, uh, but then again, no, this kind of it, it kind of did market like Ultra kind of marked the or, or precursed it mainly um, because. So um, Ultra Street Fighter Four wasn't going to be on X, uh, Xbox. Um, a game from Windows Live, they weren't going to have that for PC. They, they went straight to Steam. Yeah, well, yeah. games from Windows Live died already. It's exactly, no one wanted to do it. But you know, yeah. that, probably, that probably you know kinda was it was a hint towards saying, okay, yeah, probably we're not going to do it because Microsoft probably, you know, they, they they probably aren't treating Capcom correctly. You know, and uh, of course it's like that's karma on Capcom's side because Capcom's been, been messing up themselves. But you know, Windows, I mean, um, like Xbox or Microsoft, they may not be, they may not be um, giving Capcom a fair share or something. Well, they don't need. Maybe something in the background. But they don't really need to pay them. It's like they're gonna make a game. Like, well, they probably pay. Like, of course, you have to pay a licensing fee. Everyone has to pay a licensing yeah, fee. Yeah, licensing fee. But, uh, but besides that, like, what, it's, you the, know, what's you know. What are the costs for each licensing fee for Capcom? No, but uh, they won't have a different licensing fee for different games. Microsoft will still make their cut, like the same amount of cut they make for every game. But the thing about uh, one of the one of the theories they were saying that uh, Microsoft, because you have this about to be this going to be um, crossplay. Yeah, for the PS the, P- the PS4 and PC, and they said that Microsoft won't allow crossplay, no, which sure. makes which. For the PS4 to the PS4, I mean the Xbox to the one to the PS4, that makes sense. But I don't think for they would. St- I don't think they would do it for the PC because it's Microsoft Windows. Yeah, why would Mi- Why would not Microsoft? But again, it won't be on live. <laughs> it wouldn't be on live, but they won't. Yeah, they, they won't already they already disbanded that. That's that doesn't exist anymore. Yeah, Microsoft so Live doesn't uh, on live doesn't go. exist anymore. I because you're you're thinking about. I was gonna think about who's gonna hold this the. The PC servers. If it's going to be Steam, I don't think they're going to see Steam really working with games from Windows Live. If games are, are leaving games from Windows Live. No, no, no. I mean, Microsoft already they 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 axed the program. Windows Live doesn't yeah. games from Windows Live doesn't exist. But anymore. if it's going to be Steam, I don't think Steam is going to be working with um, Xbox Live. So remember, that's what that's what happened with Team Fortress. Team Fortress, they wanted it to be. Um, but that was that's the thing is that was is that was years ago. No, but this is this is the issue. That same the same reason. Kind of carries it today is just the amount of updates they want to give. They want to keep on updating like all the all the time. You remember how many times you see updates on Steam, but then you have to wait like that. But the thing the server the servers won't change as much. No, it won't. It, actually, the servers will. You know, the server no, the servers. The servers just the server will be always a server. You have to ping it. You have to make sure to you have to no, but this is, connect to it. It won't it won't change as much. No, but this is the thing. It's all about balances in the gameplay. Yeah, no, no, I'm, I'm not saying get to that. Yeah, no, I'm saying, but like, if you're up with Steam is updating. Huh? But when you when you're watching, yeah, that can happen. It's just that when people have to play that game. No, but I'm I'm saying this is what I'm saying. Like when they update Steam, they usually update the client. They're not updating the servers. The servers are totally different things. Whoever runs those servers are open. Like so, pretty much whoever's running the run people that are running the Team Forces is of course Steam. It's Valve. Yeah, it's Valve. But sure. whoever's gonna be running those servers for um, for Street Fighters is not gonna be Valve. It's gonna be it's gonna be Capcom. Most likely, well, or the, people or so um, Capcom doesn't doesn't do their servers. Okay, then it'll be yeah. someone. Uh, it'll, be, like, it'll be it'll be it'll be another company, but it won't be Steam directly. Maybe not directly. Yeah, we'll we'll see. Cause um, it could. Yeah, it's, it's, it's an option of it being Steam. It's just how many times the the client's gonna be updated. Because that means that the client's gonna be. But it's the same thing with the P- PS4. They un- if they update, the they'll have to. Wallet. Like it'll be the same thing with the PS4. If they update, it's the same thing, really. Because they update, it won't ch- it won't change the. Well, di- if pretty much a server always gonna be the same thing. A server is just no, yeah, because the, ser- the server's there, it connects. But the only, but the only thing someone's playing a different thing, like 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 imagine this, like when they update Steve, uh, Street Fighter, you know, update update Street Fighter on. A uh, matter of fact, go back no, to it's like just a, there, there'll be a, just like a patch. If there's a patch for the PS4, this could be a patch for the PC. 
Yeah, which is like same how, thing. Like, it's how similar. many times would it update compared to the PC version? It'll be the same thing because most the PS yeah, the, the PS4 the and the Xbox are built on PC architecture now, so it's not like there's anything different really. Whatever the same type of processor gonna, that's in here, the same amount of time, like the same type yeah. of processor in here is the same as my computer, but it's different. This is AMD. Yeah, that's so Intel. How, yeah, so it's the same the, thing. Um, see how the patches work on each. Yeah. Yeah, but even if they 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 balance it, it's just gonna be patched. Even if like, but the game like P, the PS the Street Fighter has been unbalanced most of uh, sometimes. Oh well, yeah. But, but it but it, it, but it takes a while to it's, it's, it's a, it takes a while to steady it to balance it. But once it's balanced, they don't really don't throw out a patch anymore. If it's if it's yeah. need to, if something needs to change, they'll change it. So that doesn't that doesn't that doesn't make an excuse that Microsoft will, is stopping like that's Microsoft will stop that like yeah, stopping yeah. them from making it, you know, yeah, making, a, it making that in, happen. Yeah, like in, in, a, in a normal term, yeah, it wouldn't be an excuse. But again, Microsoft has it has that choice. It's just I remember there were so many other games that were supposed to do it. Even like what's it, um, Shadow Runner, uh, Shadow Run supposed to do that not many people played it though because again you know uh, I guess it was really buggy I didn't, I didn't hear about that but every other game was supposed to do even Team Fortress like even um, you know I remember Counter Strike tried to do it but it was again you know the, the way you play the game too well Counter Strike was on the Xbox yeah it went to Xbox um, 360 and they, yeah. and that, that's, that's, that's what I'm saying that's what I'm saying this, is, made, um, I'm just, I'm saying. Uh, this is the a new a new day pretty much Counter Strike all those, all, yeah, all those games are old so, those old policies are dead and gone. So now Xbox already is already is in a bad place. Why would they stop crossplay? That's what I'm saying. They need people. They need people to buy this the system. Crossplay, crossplay will stop, but then again, this I think they want the sales themselves. Because mm-hmm. like again, you, you know you're gonna you're gonna have crossplay, but people want to pay like, like, like pay for the PS4 version when you want them to play like, like, to play with. You, you know, that's like PS4 is going to make their money. Yeah, of course, they're going to make the same amount of money anyway. So, like, if anything, that that you know, there's an accumulative of, of, of the things that this is. Well, right? this is what I, I know. Pretty much, there, of course, there was going to be a cross play between the the Xbox One and PS4. There's going to be a cross play between the PS4, PC, P, um, cross play between the Xbox One, PC, and it will never intersect. It will be just the PC here, Xbox here, PS4 here. So that did so making ex- exclusive besides money like Sony giving them money, it, like if Sony didn't give them money, it made it made no sense to be exclusive. They already said they are, but that that's that's not why um, Capcom said, oh no, we're only making it for PS4 because they're making they're making it easier. No, they're they're making it easier because they're lubing our pockets and giving us money. That's true. Yeah. So, so they they can probably do that. You know. Yeah. But yeah. Okay. Also. Uh, uh, if you guys haven't know, um, have not known, um, there was a little, little incident in um, Australia f- or for Australia um, Target and Australia um, Walmart. They're, I think they're owned by the same people in Australia. It's kind of weird. It's different from here over here. So pretty much there was a petition for with fifty thousand people, and they pretty much pulled it from those two stores, Target and Walmart. And pretty much it was a petition saying that, oh, it's protruding um, um, violence. It's pretty much portraying violence against women. And they're getting points for killing women. Which pretty much I, all these little petitions and all this other stuff. And people who are bashing Grand Theft Auto since the like, beginning of time. They all, or, or any game. Is always, they always have their information wrong. There's nothing in the game that makes you say, oh, kill, these, kill the hooker. To get your to get get nothing tells you kill get this help. one woman unless is in a mission and like, she's yeah, her try to fuck with you. Yeah, she and she did something to you. You know. Yeah, she tried to kill you, but most of the time, most of the people that you're fighting and killing are men, and but all this violence yeah, is equal. But mainly, at the end of the day, after you kill these characters, you go outside. You gotta go to the same job, talk to the same people. I mean, nothing really happens. And the thing is that really makes it, you. The thing that makes it even funnier because they said they, they they specifically said children, but in Australia it's even harder for like a minor to get video games. They really, really, really enforce it. So the only way they can get get it is from parents, and for some reason parents are so retarded that they can't. It's like oh, I'll, I'll, if it's if it's rated, I know how to. It say Peggy eighteen for them, yeah, so it definitely says eighteen. 
So when they get the game and they see it, it's Peggy 18, I think it's the same thing for the movies. So they know it's for 18 and up, but for some reason, we're still in this, this like we're still in this little bizarre world that for some reason video games cannot be adult. Yeah. So that people, when people, when, state of mind. so when people buy the game, they say, "Oh, it's a like video game, so it's for children." Yeah, it, it, it's, it's, it's adult arrogance. Yeah, amazing. it's adult arrogance. Arrogance. A video game is is another another vessel to tell a story. It's the same thing as a movie. And not the same thing, but it's the same no, thing no, as no, a book. It's, 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 it's just more interactive. Yeah, it's it. interactive. But it has the same So aspect, it's so. those people, those old people's mindset. And then when they find their kids, same like, name. they find their kids, like, bashing, a, a bashing in, like, a old lady's, um, old lady's, like, <laughs> skull or whatever. A skull, and then they go, oh, my God, this video game, man, this is not for children. Yeah, it's not for children, because it says Peggy 18. It says M for mature. It's all these other things. It says A, pl- a plus for adults and all the Adults and over, yeah, A-O. A-O, oh, yeah. adults only. And and people are still saying, oh, this is bad, it's bad. Shut the fuck up, man. Like, really? Like, go, like, you watch, <laughs> you can watch so much terrible, like, stuff. Well, not terrible, like, with kids... Kids could be I mean, able to watch of, that. I mean, the amount of time these parents fight. They could be teaching their kids. Yeah, they're teaching their kids a lot more than those games are. I mean, the amount of time you don't spend, you know, you, you don't spend with your kid. The amount of time you curse somebody who, like, who cut you off in the drive, in driveway or whatever. They're learning that from you. Yeah. So, mm-hmm. Grand Theft Auto. It's not really doing and, You know, it's only, the only, only bad part is that Grand Theft Auto relates to it. Yeah. You know, so kids can actually get engaged into the game a lot better, but... There has to be a way, way for them to relate. They have to have some prior experience. Hmm. You know, where did that come from? The thing is that I just I always say this every time. Like, I even say it to myself or, like, I always think it. Every time these stupid news parts about games and I say, I say this. Back in old times when they only had fucking, was it black and white pictures? Before there was violence on the screen because violence... And when you were trying to... Violence, violence, unless it was, like, a cowboy movie... Violence was not that. Pong, pong, yeah. yeah, violence was not that prevalent in the back back in the day. And if it was not, it was like it was like com- it was like comedy. It was either like little stick, com- like little like um slapstick humor. Slapstick humor. Even back in then, there were murderers. One of the like some like some of, like some of like the the most iconic murderers like were from back in the day. Like even before that, even before that movie, like Jack the Ripper or something like that. Even though if he was real or not. There was like, someone he was based off. He was based off someone, and there were those murders. Mur- those murders did exist, and that was before movies existed, before the, pi- the pi- before the, like they were even. Now you to tell you mean to tell me that reading shapes that form letters and form words are you to kill somebody? Exactly. I mean, well, he read it in a book. That's from the back in the day. That's what it was. They were burning books. Oh, this book is not good. You can't write devil. The book, but, but then they see you. Burning things, mm. yelling, insulting things, and, and then these kids are growing up to do the same exact thing. You can't blame the books that you just burned. Mm. So you have to learn from something. You 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 know. You know pretty much, pretty much, there's pretty much there's people that pretty much. I I'll, I'll say this. Um, monsters are born and created. There are people that are just... Well, actually, the monsters are created. I'll say that. They're yeah, not they born. Are. I mean, because they're, they're conditioned. They're conditioned. And there's some people that just are... Like, there's some people that are just... Are born. Some people are just... They're born with there's a little thing. There, there's, something, there's something up with them. Something wrong with them. But there's always just, a way to save them from becoming a monster. Yeah. It's just and whether or not you want to go down that route. Yeah. You know? So, this... Uh, so, that's what... But pretty much, uh, this whole article is about uh, the CEO of um, Take-2 uh, take pretty much says... If you don't like our game, don't buy it. It's like, and pretty much you have to be a little honest with it. Yeah, little little too. If you don't like it, don't buy it. Like, if you don't support us, don't support us. That makes sense. They also yeah. also pretty much made a, a a big point of how forty million people, forty four million people already bought their games, so it's not really hurting them. Also, yeah, roughly making like also like two billion, you know, yeah. two billion dollars. Also, so. like if it's a slippery slope, having having this game being pulled off the shelves because only a few only 50,000 compared to 44 the 34 million people yeah that enjoy the game 50,000 people or uh, there's probably more but 50,000 people 
didn't like the game. It's and probably simply, some of them yeah. bought the game just to say, and then they, they found it they didn't like it. Yeah, that's true. So that's, that's true. still sales too. I mean, yeah. they they go back to the GameStop, you know, yeah. get nine dollars off of that shit. Yeah, yeah. but it's like it's a slippery slope in like a free society. This is a free society. It's a freedom. Like everyone's a, this adult game for adults, yeah. so they have the right they to buy, buy or not buy the game. You shouldn't. They, it's pretty much like like pretty much is like a, like oppressing like freedom of expression. It's pretty much pushing, like it's pretty much thrown out the window. It's a slippery slope. Like take that out. So that's that's pretty much like it's pretty good read. You could uh, I think he has a uh, a whole interview in uh, one of the sources of game industry. I guess this source right here. And you could uh you could read the whole this whole interview this whole uh, statement from here. All right. Next uh oh, nope not right now. <laughs> Next, uh, another uh, company I respect deeply. Uh, the Witcher Three has been being oh, the pushed. Game, back. Yeah. yeah, the game uh, is being pushed back till May nineteenth. So about um, almost a, like pretty much a full, almost a month. Like it's about three, three weeks or something like that. Twelve weeks. Well, May nineteenth. That's roughly. That's like right like after the twenty fourth. Yeah, about a month. It's about a month because it was coming out the twenty fourth of February. Oh no no no! That's 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 like three months. That's three months. So that's like that's roughly when the Avengers. Yeah, come out. it was it was twelve weeks. Yeah, it's, it's about it's three months. Yeah, the, the Avengers come out like right before that. So oh, pretty yeah. much, uh, this game. And the funny thing, I just bought it, the game, but I got I got it for I got a was it twenty percent off of it? So I said, fuck it, let me just buy it. But um, this game, pretty much, uh, they really they delayed it because they there was some stuff they want to polish and they didn't want to be like. All the games that came out recently mm-hmm. that have all these ma- like major bugs, like like Ubisoft with with Assassin's Creed and um, was it three three four three yeah. with Master Chief the horrible horrible matchmaking and yeah this yeah they didn't want to be like them so they said you know what we gotta we gotta just like step back and and make sure the game runs perfectly before we throw it out. Which which Ubisoft should have done, like the game should the, when before they released it, the game should have been done. Like, if, like if you're about to release a game, it should be done, like two months before the game comes out. And in those two months, you should be able to you should be, like fucking, like, hitting it hard with all these different tests, playing it, playing it, different systems, like all these different systems to see how. It, it is in a mid, mid mid range, low mid range. Is testing the shit out of it. Those two last months, that's what you should be doing. And so it was a CD project. Red, they saw that. They said, "Oh shit, the game kind of has some bugs there, there, and there." So they decided, you know what? We got to limit all the bugs and make sure it's a perfect, it's a perfect game, close to perfect game. Yeah, I mean, we know the game's coming out. The game's gonna come out. We're yeah. gonna play the game. We're, so gonna be, we're gonna have the money to buy. Actually, it. It, it, I believe. This is this is reminds me of the old like the old days of how games came out, and when, when, well the Xbox one, Xbox three hundred and sixty and PS three game days, because how many times um, Grand Theft Auto was delayed, how many times uh, five? how many times I think Gears of War was delayed a couple times before the second one, and the third one. I think yeah, I know like like even back in like the PC days when things. Where it will be patched, games still took a while. Like yeah. again, Gold Wars Two supposed to come out like I don't know when, but they they, they kept getting pushed back until twenty twelve. Yeah. Even what um, this is one game that kept getting pushed pushed back even even during like the the Xbox days where you couldn't patch anything. Yeah, where so. you know like who knows when the hell you know what Halo Two came out in what two thousand four? Yeah, I believe it. I think yeah, so. even though it was. It was announced in like 2002, 2003. You know, so waiting. So like, like back time. like back in those days, they like they would push back games. I, I it's, it would it wouldn't be like it would be normal for games to to be delayed. Gran, Gran Turismo. Yeah, Gran Turismo was definitely delayed. I know that. Remember, yeah, we had one game. Like Gran Turismo yeah. Four, yeah, it yeah, was delayed yeah. a couple times. Even Killzone, yeah. Killzone was delayed a couple you times. Too, list, yeah, but like remember those. It was like kills on kills on lied, you know kills on lied, but um, Gran Turismo, yeah. people were waiting for a long. No, matter of fact, what is it? No, no, um, we were waiting a long time for Metal Gear Solid Four. 
It wasn't but delayed. That, that, but that was no. delayed. No, no, because we we were just waiting a long time. We were waiting for a long time. It's because because what Konami does is different. He doesn't announce anything. He doesn't make sure know. he doesn't have a solid date until he knows the game is perfect. Like it has bit, yeah, it has it. no bugs, and yeah, I don't, I don't think, I don't think anyone really found any bugs. No, but he's, yeah, but in, he's, in he's doing Metal Gear. He's for yeah, he's doing what everybody else should be doing. Well, well, what they're doing. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah, like, right now, because pretty much what people are just looking for to exactly. get the get the the get the um, to go through the the holiday um, was it the holiday rush and all that? And you know the funny thing, they already yeah, had they were like movies. Ubisoft already had problems with. Like games before, um, before Assassin's Creed, um, there was like the PC version for uh, the PC version for Watch Dogs was yeah. buggy as all hell, buggy. and people it was crashing multiple times. I remember what was it? Uh, Track Ma- Trackmania Two that got delayed around twice when it came out. The server was fucking crashed. And when it came out, that you know, it had a couple. Of, uh, no, it only had one bug. It was that uh, like half the features that it was supposed to have wasn't uh, wasn't released the, uh, the initial day. So, yeah. so that's, like, that's 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 the thing about games now. It's like, and this is the, uh, I'm happy that this like studio is really like, studio and like these studios like Grand Theft like uh, with the like Take Rockstar Two and then Rockstar and they the like CD they Project, yeah. they make sure games are polished enough that it will come out. And besides the P- well, the Grand Theft Auto Four for the um, PC, it's kind of yeah. buggy. Yeah, kind of yeah. Now they the they actually have a person that did um, Max Payne, the the um, yeah. that did the the port for Max, not the port, but like they built up. They're bringing everybody in. They bring, for yeah, they're bringing those guys that did that to, just so they can do Grand Theft Auto, Grand Theft Auto Five online. So yeah, those what, are those people. Yeah, I'm like uh, GTA Five. Was well, supposedly made for a PC. Uh, you know, uh, you know, spiritually it was made for the PC, but yeah. it kind of yeah. Uh, the way the way you see it, all the features, they kind of, you know, were getting ready for a PC release. Yeah. So hopefully, so they were like working that shit for like you know for for the, for, the, for the two years it's been out. Yeah. Well, Hope- no, one year it's been out. Yeah. Hopefully, so hopefully people. that like hopefully more studios start follow suit and decide like okay, if the game's not finished, delay it because people are still gonna buy a game. Yeah, people will buy Assassin's if Assassin's Creed came out be after Christmas, even like next year, yeah, they'll still buy the same amount that they buy but when they first when they first came out. So, yeah. Also, a little fun thing. Thanks, Obama. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> but uh, yeah, uh, pretty much Obama completed his first code this week, and it's not that big of a deal, but it's just a changing of times, which is awesome. That. I think that my son would probably be a way better programmer than me when I was his age, because now now they're gonna try to put more, uh, was it more um, computer science classes and make it like a mandatory thing. Yeah. For ma- yeah. for every for all cl- for all for all, you for were talking s- about that on yeah for the for the last one yeah. make it a mandatory thing and make it put that in all schools, and if they do that, that makes sense. Have ha- like let them learn about the computers and just. It's gonna be amazing, how? Because well, in after our generation, the people, the people like our generation that grew up before computers, yeah. that grew up before computers really got anything, like, because we like before like we were on computers, but not really. With dial up and everything, people were running on computers, but now every single thing's a computer on a computer. Yeah, and now that so people, you don't think it's now people that grew up with like that ne- never grew up with dial up, never grew up with like slow internet. <laughs> I want to see how they grow, and they're like, and, and I hope, and I'm ha- happy that it's not gonna be like, oh, I just they they grew up with no internet and stuff like that. I mean, the thing is, they grew up with um, they grew up with good internet and everything. They grew but up they, before net neutrality. Yeah. Well, if this if this goes through, but like, if it go through, yeah. But oh. it, like if they like now is not like oh I'm just using this tool for Instagram and all this bullshit. No, I'm like oh no, I'm gonna make the next Instagram. I'm gonna make the next program, which is gonna be amazing. I just can't wait to that time. Like. In 15 years, it's gonna be I'll a see. hackers' generation. Hacker, yeah. It's gonna be a hackers' generation. It's gonna be a frenzy. Everything has to be coded better because now everyone knows how to code. <laughs> it's gonna be have to code it airtight. It's you gotta move things. Gotta move things back to being you know uh, manual labor. Yeah. <laughs> it would be like people in, in uh, McDonald's programming like 
<laughs> this is your pro- this is your this is your meal. Exactly. Like they're, they're all like. So I pro- like, you're like run your blood into the program. Oh, you want this today? Clip. <laughs> people in the Amish country want to be gods because they can't be touched. You know, yeah. the Amish overlords. <laughs> No, but oh yeah, they were, what if the Amish people re, like since it, oh, what if the Amish people, people no 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 but what if the Amish people since Amish people don't use technology they only use like old timey technology what if <laughs> and what they, they use iPhones they start using old like back at like what is in fifteen years they start using iPhones all old technology they only use dial up matter of fact they, they, they start using the bricks they start using, they use the bricks, brick phones so. but then they become untouchable. Because everyone else is hacking each other, killing you know, destroying each other's lives. But, but then no one can hack them because no one, one can understand the, the old old technology. You can understand the old, you know, and, and the thing is, the Amish they, they do everything manually so they can survive anything. Yeah. I mean, hell, like the Amish are going to be the gods. You know, the Amish were getting ready. The Amish were getting ready to to, to to rule by just being regular farmers. You know, they were like just tending the crops like soon. Yeah, <laughs> that'd be funny. Uh, so yeah, it's a it's a um next uh, story is uh. With stretchable artic- artificial skin that can give the prosthetic like the sense of touch so mm. every time I see this is just like amazing so I'm just I, I, I'm so ready for the future when I lose my arm <laughs> <laughs> and then I could put up a new well, arm so ready I'm, and it's I'm, like I'm, it's I'm picking so up a bit like ooh it's pretty cold I'm so ready to get amputated right now man no, yeah, no, yeah. One day someone's gonna chop off my arm. I like, no, no, right, we got, we gotta wait, we gotta wait. We, we can't be, we, 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 they, we, don't, they have, they don't have the technology. They can't rebuild us. <laughs> they can't rebuild us yet. No, no, no. <laughs> not, not to our, our, our liking. Not, not yet. No, no. I well, can't wait till that time. Like, you already have that. But it's probably like, like two weeks. Yeah. Who's <laughs> always gonna fucking do that? We have, we still have MIT around. It was two weeks. So yeah, this, this pretty. I mean, really like, nice. yeah. Like, how long did we th- really think that? They want to have the sense of touch in, in prosthetics. Like we thought we were gonna be like fucking in wheelchairs and everything. Yeah. I mean, I'm eating the fucking Domino's pizza at, at one a.m. I'm health. I'm 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 I'm, I'm healthy as I, as I really need to be right now. <laughs> and then we have, you know, like prosthetics with senses. I'm like Jesus, man, what what's gonna happen? We have Oculus Rift, sense, oh. prosthetic senses. Yeah. I mean, what the fuck are we gonna? It's gonna be some crazy shit. Man. Like three D printing, we can like I can draw a tower in three D space. I'm like guys, you know. Yeah. You know, I, I, you know what? What are we going to be looking at? What are we? What are we going to be talking about when we are in walkers? We are yeah. wheelchairs. When we have to be like either in assisted living or when I'm like out there like, at the lake with with my my artist house, just painting, talking about my grandkids. Yeah. How is that going to happen? What are we going to be doing? Like, what what are we going to be looking at? Yeah, that's are these things going to fucking fly? Are we are we going to be flying in our houses? <laughs> Well, well, maybe. I don't know. This uh, are, you know, are, are we going to be talking to our Amish overlords over holograms? <laughs> <laughs> what are we going to do? <laughs> maybe, maybe. But yeah, that's that's just really cool. Oh, also, in a, a move that came out of nowhere, you know about freemium games. Everyone knows about freemium, freemium games. Yeah. Pretty much, you buy it. It's Candy Crush. Kind of. Yeah. That, yeah. Yeah. It's not pay to win, but it's pay, pay to, to get pay to, pay to get some get cl- further away. I mean, get yeah, get the, get closer pay, to the pay, goal pay, that pay pay, get to closer to the goal that is just a game exist. that doesn't give you anything really. Yeah, pay so pretty platter, much yeah. Google is now like starting to refund. Um, was it refunding nine million dollars? Nineteen million. Nineteen million dollars. Jesus. Of get, um, in games purchases. So, all those little like little kids that you just gave your iPod. I mean, they gave oh, your especially Android. Yeah, you gave your Android to. And you're just buying games and stuff like that. But that, that they figure, they go start refunding all those stuff. Yeah, so. well, that really tells me that Google's pretty honest with their money too. Yeah. If they have the, they still have that 19 million or whatever. No, but the thing is, the 19 million. Well, it's, it's, it's not, it's not, back. it's not their game. It's no, something no, else. They, but but they're, they're taking but, it from. Yeah. But again, you know, you, you know, because you, you're not, you're not paying it on, um, on, on Google Play. Not, not too much, not too much. But they still have money around that they didn't. You know, put to the side. You know, of course, there was like no embezzlement, but I have nineteen million dollars just to refund people. Yeah, that that kind of shows that they they're, they're being really honest with their money. Because the thing is, don't you uh, remember you 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 pay through something. You, you pay through um, you pay through the app, but don't doesn't it go through like their service? Like, don't they get a cut? Well, they get stuff? they get a cut. Yeah, yeah. So they're they're probably taking out of their cut to say, you know what. 
you know. But you, sorry you, for. But the, the thing is that you that you, you have to um you have to start um applying. You have to apply for it. You have to. They won't just give it. No, they, no, they won't know. Yeah, but like, but it was, you just have to apply for it. Yeah. And it's starting. Uh, and they'll probably like look up your information or something. Actually, it started. It started. Hopefully. It started already. Started. Okay. But they, yeah, they made December. Oh, 2015 yeah. though. Oh, they have until twenty. Oh, until December second. Oh, next. Oh, ne- oh, a whole next, year. You yeah, got a whole year. Of next next year. Yeah. So you know until Star Wars That's comes out. Yeah. Start signing up for that shit, man. Yeah. So if your son for some reason paid a thousand dollars on any of those freemium games, like to get five levels up in you know Candy Crush Saga because he sucks. Yeah. Then, yeah, Google's willing to um help you out. Yeah. Uh, also, uh, if you guys notice that the Pirate Bay was. Shut down. It wasn't because Pirate Bay been plundered. Yeah, it wasn't because of uh, uh, the server. <laughs> this is going down for a bit. They actually raided the servers and the took police, all the, the police actually went inside the internet yeah. and busted through the doors. No, the real ones. But <laughs> yeah, the but real doors. But and the thing is, think about it. I think about it. I think they built it. They built it inside, like the side of a mountain or something. Like some James I mean, Bond I mean, stuff. Yeah, some old like, like it's so crazy. Shit, been, I mean, like then again, like it's fucking Swedish, so like all the awesome shit happens over there because you know everybody's kind of equal. But yeah. <laughs> like, damn, dude, you know, you got it. You had to talk to a couple of a couple of friends about that. A couple yeah. of your Scandinavian friends and see what happened there. Yeah, true. And probably they have more information on that than uh. That's true. That's true. Than we do. But the thing, the thing is also um. The thing is that they can, if they could, they probably just could move it to a different outside of Sweden, and where places like it's not really that it was lax, and so they don't really care. Like Alcatraz. Yeah. Like As long Rikers Island. Just. But yeah. Or Fort Knox. The thing like is that this is not. Then. Of course, it's not going to stop piracy. It's it's just one website. Yeah. There's so I many mean, websites. Like, how many people have those turrets now? Yeah. How many people are seeing? I mean, this is this is actually. Oh, yeah, just and the, the thing is that it's just just the website. Yeah, as long as you just have just the showing, this is just showing what you how many people have this torrent. Yeah, this is the biggest one out of all of them. Yeah, but the thing is that the the, the the getting computers doesn't do anything. Is if you have the the torrent, they thought they, tr- they, they thought and they you have like a little ac- unless they they could shut down the access point, but not really. As long as someone's seeing it, yeah. someone else can get it. So. I mean, like you know, it's, yeah. You you just you just shut down the, uh, the 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 town square of yeah. uh, of Torrance. You know, you shut down you shut down you know Union Square, but there's still hipsters and, and bashers <laughs> walking around. You know, yeah. they're gonna see flat tops somewhere else. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. so. It's not stopping it, but just uh i feel like in the fu- in the future this is gonna be so much better ways to steal shit <laughs> well, of course i mean like because like, they look look at how, t- how how long it took for them to really get this far even if they had to do like even if the, the people you know police had to do stuff on the back to get like the warrants or whatever you know they had to get the permission they had to like get the information and make sure this is like like some 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 bin laden kind of crap yeah. you know they had to but the like, thing the thing is that get the green light the thing is that uh the last yeah, time the, the last time Pirate Bay was taken down, that was eight years ago, and it took them a long time, and they exactly. finally take it down, and then they got the two people that that um that uh, m- created it, and they one served a year, and another one is serving like a year and a half yeah. or something. But a year and a half, that. Yeah, but one is already out already. Yeah. And this, thing. but the thing is that these websites, even though they give you a platform to share. They say you can share whatever you want. Go ahead. Yeah. Pretty much the next step is what its next step is gonna be um um encrypted torrents. Like encrypted torrents. So someone sends you a link or you find a link to it, something, they'll send you a link and as long as you have the link, it's there's a torrent. So it's easy to, for anyone, even even like a, a even if even like FBI can find that link. But the person that owns that website has no authority, like, Oh, I don't know I didn't know what the link was. It was, it was encrypted from like I can't even exactly. see it. All only people with the was just all they did was got the file. That's yeah, it. only only people that can see the link is the person that created that link. So it has nothing to do with me. So that's what that's what um mega mega um remember mega upload. Yeah, not mega the new the, his new website. That's what it's all about. 
only only people that know about the link is the people that have the link, and he can't. The, the website doesn't know what you're sharing. So he. Oh, so wait, I remember it was Mega Video, and then there was Mega Upload. Yeah, then those are, those were shut down, but he has his own now. Just called Mega.com, and th- that and that is all encrypted, and he does, like the website doesn't know what you're sharing, so they can't can't take any they, they can't um no they can't take anything right. down because they don't know what it is. Exactly. So. Yeah, that, that, yeah. And, oh yeah, the last um, to be taken. last uh, story of the day. Grumpy Cat. Mm. What so for the two years that like, Grumpy Cat was in existence, for over two years, the owner of Grumpy Cat made a hundred million dollars in two years. Mm. Just like what they say. Anything is possible. Anything is fucking possible. You put your mind to it. Once you put your mind to it, you can do anything you want. <laughs> or you just buy a cat that has an overbite that everyone yeah, loves. She has an over, uh, overbite, <laughs> like, she, she was, she's manager of the fucking year, though. Yeah, she... She's manager so, of... She's, a, she's like one of the best managers ever. Yes, yeah, she pretty much... And she was just a waitress back when she before she this happened. So pretty much exactly. what she did... So pretty much what she did, she did start doing... Imp- um, um, she started doing uh, appearances on, like, Ellen and all these shows... So they, she was paying, being paid for appearances, interviews. She she had two books, top telling books. They had a little like move. They had a movie, did commercials, and even have she even have her own like cappuccino called Grumpuccino. I mean, like Grumpy Cat's um, Grumpuccino. It's it's crazy. Like, oh, we heard of this update, huh? Isn't update now? Yeah, it says wait. Well, it might not be quite a hundred million. No, it's I close. think it might be close enough. Like, it's, it's probably a, not a, not a documented hundred million, but she has a lot. She has like businesses now. She has a business. She's selling books. Let's see, that's special. Blah blah blah. Piss good. Raked in. It might not be quite. Rest assured though, she's giving plenty of rich off her feeling like this. Lifetime movie, two books, and has a, a endorsement deal with Fr- even has an endorsement deal with Friskies. <laughs> Jesus, uh, Friskies is a big big cat um the food um yeah cat food um Mobile company was the fucking food cartel right? yeah exactly. So she's yeah, she's good, <laughs> and that's the thing. That's the dream. That's American dream right there. Get a a pet that <laughs> that looks weird, and everyone takes pictures. Took a picture of it and you make you make your you make that brand. When you have something, you make a brand of it. Like that's that's the thing. That's the thing. That's what I th- that's why I believe. Um, what's her name? Failed at. Um, what's her name? I forgot her real name. She's on Discovery Channel now. I'm mean, Discovery Network on YouTube. Uh, on a rev on Revision Three, which is a part of Discovery. Mm. Uh, um, Boxy. Yeah, she's she, she's now she has she's on YouTube now. I feel I feel like she 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 didn't put her brand out that well. She pretty much kind of yeah yeah. She pretty much had those videos. She started the um, uh, she's like a pioneer of of the YouTube of, uh, yeah. of YouTube pretty much. She had her crazy video and uh, she was just really she's really she's still hyper as fuck. She's yeah. she's toned down now, but she's a pioneer of what is it? But then again, she's what of all. But, but you said she's on Discovery Channel and on Rev Three. Like she has a, she's on like it's like uh, on YouTube, yeah. Yeah, because she's not, you know, she's not a, a multi millionaire like, like this person. No, that's what that's what I'm saying. That she she, she mishandled her brand. If she when she was when it was because that was like everyone everyone that was on 4chan, but also everyone that was on the internet knew about Boxy. If she like she didn't like make a YouTube channel. She only made those two videos and pretty much like she made a video. Then she made an, another video later on. And then she disappeared. Like yeah. And then she came Fight back. Like a, yeah, like a while. Yeah. And then she came back like a lot like later later on. And then they got she got a job and we were but she if at that time if she kept putting her brand out she'd be the number yeah. she would be she'd probably be as big as um PewDiePie. Bigger. Bigger. She probably she would have been PewDiePie. She came up she came up before PewDiePie. Like PewDiePie's size like yeah, like back in like two thousand eight. I yeah. remember she she you know she was big. She was big for a while. Yeah. Because right? um, after she left, you started seeing like Shane Dawson, Onision, and 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 like I think Smosh or whatever. Those guys tried to start, 
you know. And then you get uh, what's his name? Uh, what's his name? Philip DeFranco. Not Philip DeFranco. Um, the other guy. But he also does. Um, Ray William Johnson. Ray William Johnson. Is he the equal three guy? Yeah, equal three guy. Equal three. Yeah. Ray yeah, that guy, that guy. But these guys. Yeah. He, you know, but the thing is that he retired. He's. I think he's like a kind of a. He's a millionaire. Yeah. That's he okay. retired because you know he retired a millionaire. They, they found they found their zones. They found their their, their zones. Like he he, he like just that. got tired of doing it, and he was making a he was making a lot of money just finding yeah. like little videos and stuff like that. And he was making a lot of money. Because even with um, because most of his videos with his most of his videos was like almost like like ten million views. Yeah, I was I, I was subscribed to him too. We'll call that. That's where we we'll call that. Um, I think that's that that's that's kind of the situation. That that's the emotional situation that the boxer probably has. She just she's just finding where she is. I yeah. you know there's there's of course much higher she can go, but I don't she's think she really wants to. No, 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 I'm not, I'm not, I'm not saying that, but I'm just saying that. If she if, if that she if, stay, she, yeah. if she stayed she there, stayed there her she, brand she would just be she could have just retired like, every, like everybody like, would have been compared to her like Ray William Johnson like he could have retired like, because it was just him and maybe like another person doing like yeah, doing edits. the doing the edits two people and making those it's just like how yeah. PewDiePie is probably, like she probably would have had a show on TV yeah that's like that's how PewDiePie is like definitely a, a millionaire because he's the one editing his videos yeah. it's only him <laughs> that's exactly so. so and now he's on South Park and all this other yeah, stuff. Yeah, he's on South Park. Yeah, yeah. like the new, like even the uh, the first. I don't know if he's in the second part of the episode because there's two. It was a two part episode, but he was in the first part and he's only there for a couple, couple seconds. And I bet he got paid for that. Lovely. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So yeah, these people have. It's yeah. like it's it's crazy. Like you just that's why like if you handle your brand, like you get you get a part, you get something, and you handle it right, and just keep doing it, and see like oh people are, and just keep going, and just don't stop, then. It's just crazy, man. And um, also similar to uh, what's his name? Oh, who was that guy? Um, you know the guy. You know the guy with the uh, you know that meme with the guy with the gla- um braces. And uh, uh, the glasses. Bad luck, Brian. Yeah, he actually no, came back. Remember, he, yeah, he had, he had the he had the braces. He had the smile. He yeah. said like yeah. The thing is that he came back and he was on this um channel. I don't know what ca- came of him. I think he's still on the channel, but like, he really isn't that funny. But he got a job because of that meme. Oh, yeah, it's like it's th- yeah. like this now day and age. Like if you're funny on the internet, or you have a meme on the internet that puts you out there, like the gr- like the girl, the girl that uh that did that uh the you know that little yeah the uh, the she could like she, right now she could be like they have a YouTube channel, just have a YouTube channel. And have like keep do her doing keep doing that that little. Because remember, she had a vine. She started doing vines about herself. Yeah. So. And you see, like you know, she she, and she, got, and she got like money and you know she cleaned herself up a little bit. Even yeah. um, I mean, who call it? Um, Antoine Dotson. Oh example. yeah. You know. Um, yeah. He, he was the first. He was, the first or the uh, the first big um auto tune the news. Yeah. And then, you know, he's just. Laying on money now. He, yeah, he, he, that's that's what I say. You, once you find your, uh, yeah, because like, because now now everything is ruled by pretty much advertising. Like, well, it's always been ruled by advertising, but ev- all these people that are making money, they're making money off of advertising. Put like people put it put it like being endorsed, and that's what all the thing is about being endorsed. Yeah. But once you get an endorsement, and you can like feed off like feed off of that, and just get keep getting bigger and bigger, but grow at your rate, then it's amazing. But yeah, yeah, grow up a cat, hundred million empire. <laughs> for now, yeah, at, at, at this point, for now, this, remember this point. If, she, if she's if she's smart, smart enough, she just keep it, keep it rolling, keep it small, it? keep it only on okay, cat food and stuff like that that can handle, and then and then he'll end up and in then the, like and then in, the, in the adventures, yeah, <laughs> and then like make sure she puts that money somewhere that could, it could grow. Don't yeah, spend invest, all that money. Invest that much, yeah. Right. Yeah, and just keep it simple, and then have her keep going around for a couple of years, and then the tours and everything, with and the then just guy. disappear, and then when Grumpy Cat dies, even though it might be it'll be sad, have a mom. Have 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 Grumpy Cat like montage. Like, I'm like like they probably have, she already probably yeah, selling yeah, stuff yeah, like yeah, like shirts and yeah, stuff yeah, like that. But have that and have like. Have like a little like oh buy this DVD for Grumpy Cat all the stuff good times with Grumpy Cat yeah go, yeah like like you, know, you see like the um all those infomercials at like like twelve like twelve thirty a.m. about you know 
uh, you know the the top ten hits of Carl Grumpy Cat and shit. You know, yeah. that, and then, that, that'd be hilarious. Yeah. And, oh yeah. She also did, it was also calendars as well. She does. Like, I mean, damn. Yeah, that makes you know. sense. But oh man. And they probably have a cartoon. So matter of fact, he's oh. the new Garfield. He's the he's the new Garfield. A Grumpy Cat cartoon, like an animated Grumpy Cat cartoon. Like have, him, have, have, have him have him cross over with Garfield. You know. Yeah, that'd be oh, because yeah, have a Garfield, Garfield Grumpy Cat Garfield episode. Garfield meets Grump, Grumpy Cat. That's it. Damn, we're giving these shits out for free. <laughs> but <laughs> uh, uh, who's watching us? Yeah, 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 yeah. we can we can edit. She, what if she's we, watching we, us? We <laughs> <laughs> like she watches us like, God damn it! Like I want she, cut. She, as you team up the on the show for Lawrence and she, I want my cut. I want my cut. She's watching us through the light bulb and everything. You know, she she's Jeez. tapping into our she's tapping into our, <laughs> into, our yeah. into our phones and crap. Yeah, but uh, she, she might yeah. be listening through the beer bottle. Who knows? All right, guys. Yeah, that's it. That's that's about it. We're, we're gonna finish our beers and finish our food. Start heading heading back to the hay. Heading back, go to sleep probably. Yeah, right. We gotta like you know. Like, or whatever. We, we, we might probably do something else. We've done we've done quite we've done quite a bit. Like I started today. Start editing and make sure you guys get uh, see this. Get this early. at six p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Make sure to like and subscribe. Share us around. Yeah, and uh, keep on geeking on. Exactly. All right, guys. See you later. Peace.